hello guys welcome back to another episode of C programming tutorial on this episode I will show you an example that demonstrate the working of an if loop so here in this example I am going to print out the arithmetic and multiplication table of a number using a simple if loop so I declare a variable n it's an integer and ask the user ask the user to enter any number enter a number okay uh, now save the number into variable n using scanner function scanner percentage d is an integer so use percentage d use comma operator now provide the ampersand address operator and specify the variable name here the variable name is n okay so here I'm going to print out arithmetic table and multiplication table using two for loop two separate for loops so first here I'm going to print out the multiplication table of that number so that I declare so print of uh, print of slash n multiplication table of multiplication table of that number percentage d is uh, given below okay just uh, this is this is enough okay now put the comma operator and provide that variable name here the variable name is n that number okay uh, now we have to declare one more variable I declare another variable I again I declare another variable result okay here I initialize the variable result result with the value 1 okay now start the for loop for first initialize that variable i so this is the initialization statement i initialize the va value of i from 1 and put the condition so here i'm going to print multiplication table from 1 to 10 so the value of i less than or equal to 10 and increment that value using plus plus okay so first we have to find out the result of multiplication so result equal to here the number is n n into i so we got the multiplication result in variable result now we have to print out print that value in, in the form of a multiplication table so print of print of first is the number so first we need a new line slash n first is the number percentage d and next we need the into symbol uh, again that the value the again the second number that means here i and we got the result and you need to print the result it is also an integer okay so now we have to provide the variable name first is the number so here that variable is n second one is that incrementation value here the incrementing variable is i and finally the result of multiplication here the result is a result okay now save the program now we can check it out so I save the program uh, first compile it compilation is success now run it enter a number I enter 5 so here is the multiplication table of 5 5 into 1 equal to 5 up to 5 into 10 is 15 okay 
This is a simple multiplication table of a number using for loop. Now we have to uh, print the arithmetic table of this number. So I copy the statement, paste it here. Instead of multiplication table, here it is arithmetic table. Okay, addition table. Just put addition table of percentage D. Uh, here we do the same thing. Result is initialized from 1. And instead of this, just put plus symbol here. Because this is automatic table, addition table. Okay, save the program. Now compile it. Compilation success. Now run it. Put value 5. Here is the multiplication table and addition table of 5 is this. Guys, this is a simple example of demonstrating the working of if loop in C program. You can try out a lot of other examples like factorial of a number. Try this, try these examples, factorial of a number, uh, print the sum of integers up to n. Try these examples using a for loop and print, print the sum of Uh, digits of a number Okay, try all these uh, try this with a for loop or while loop with uh, uh, With an operator called ampersand operator. Okay. I will show you this example. I Will show you this example in the next part. Okay. Thank you for watching. See you in the next part